Hello everybody, welcome back to the Mystic Wonder. I am Veronica Ray and today we are doing a very short version of the secrets, but we're doing things differently. I'm gonna go through each zodiac and we're gonna pull the secrets on each zodiac. So if you are dealing with multiple zodiac signs, check this out, it is for the collective, okay? All right, everybody, here we go. So the first sign we're doing is Aries. So if you are an Aries or dealing with an Aries, the secret that you need to know for the weekend, what do we have? Okay, seven of wands. Wow, that is definitely your energy. And at the bottom of the deck, we have the two of chalices reversed. So some of you guys may be going through a break of a divorce, severing of ties with friends. Maybe someone has left or moved away. We have the sign of cancer and Leo strongest, but Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. I can speak, right? So this is what it's looking like. What's the secret? Well, someone's gonna be fighting for a relationship that's been over for a long time, even if it's platonic, but someone's gonna be coming in. They're coming your way, okay? Or you're coming their way. Remember, this is basically Aries, okay? <laughs> so this is like the mini secret. So someone's definitely got a grudge going on over there okay all right next one is leo leos if you are a leo or dealing with one tarot of divine secrets by me link in the description box below oh boy <laughs> what do we have we have the nine of coins so we might have a little bit of a stash of cash around the corner here or a big level up and the four of swords. This is definitely someone leaving um, a breakup or a situation behind and making money or leaving a job behind and going out on their own and becoming their own boss. Some of you guys, if you are a Leo, you're doing this. You could be also dealing with a strong Libra or a Virgo possible Gemini or Aquarius, or if it's vice versa, you guys are dealing with this Leo whoever you are dealing with the Leo. Someone's being quiet about leaving a situation is what I'm getting, okay? They're not talking, they, you know, they have plans to skedaddle basically, okay. We also have Virgo, Virgo you are next. If you are a Virgo or dealing with one, what is the secret What needs to come out about this Virgo or regarding you? Uh, one, two. We have the two of swords reversed. So someone's going to speak out, speak up, or see the light, see the truth. This is, it's like they're blinded right now, but Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, strong Libra, Gemini. And then we have the four of coins, strong Taurus, possible Capricorn or you Virgo, um, or if you're cross-watching that Virgo. So basically we got someone holding back funds, hiding money. Um, maybe they're, oh man, I feel like someone might be giving someone money in secret okay but it's going to come out within the next two days or two weeks it's coming out soon okay it is again it's really strong aquarius libra gemini or taurus energy um in conjunction with virgos so this is the card i'm pulling here is either you or the person you're dealing with so keep that in mind right okay we have capricorn all right, so what are the secrets surrounding this Cappy energy? What do we need to know? Oh, Queen of Fire and the Moon. Well, <laughs> the Moon is like saying someone's got emotional feelings, romantic vibes. You could be in love with an Aries Leo Sagittarian female or they're in love with you all in secret. Someone doesn't, if you're gay or in an open relationship, someone doesn't want to come out with it. They're hiding the love, they're hiding this beautiful queen of fire. So it's either a Capricorn hiding it or that Aries Leo Sagittarius, and of course this is water energy, but I think it's more, these are the signs, okay? But basically someone is hiding their love for someone. Uh-huh. Does not mean it's cheating, but they're hiding their love for someone. All right. We have Taurus. Boy, those earth signs are like me first. What is Taurus hiding? What Tauruses need to know? Taurus is Taurians. Okay, Ten of Wands, which is Sagittarius energy, Death card reversed, which is Scorpio. If you are Taurus or dealing with one, there's a heavy burden here and someone won't let go of it. Someone is having a hard time evolving, allowing change to occur. 
That's either you or dealing with the Taurus, the Sagittarius, or the Scorpio here. Could also be a Scorpio Sagittarian cusper. Yeah, someone, someone's been hiding a lot of stuff and they need to make a confession, but they won't do it. They're not right now. They need to, though. Scorpio, you are someone you're dealing with, right? Scorpio, we have the Knight of Air in reverse. Here he is in reverse, but here he is in the upright. Uh, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, strong Gemini on this hottie. And the Four of Coins. That's Taurus energy. So strong Gemini and Taurus dealing with Scorpio. But really, we're dealing with someone that's not talking about the money that they have, but they're asking for more. Or this is someone stashing money away for an air sign or a Scorpio. Or Scorpio is the one stashing the cash, sitting on business deals, acting like they only got one, but they're staring down three coins. Not speaking about it, not speaking the truth about the cash flow. That's what I'm getting for Scorpio. Could also be someone giving someone bad advice about money. And Gemini, you are next, or you are dealing with a Gemini. This is interesting. I'm keeping it short and sweet today, folks. All right, we have the Empress reversed in the moon. Ooh, okay. You could be dealing with an Aries, a Taurus, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, or that Gemini, or you are that Gemini. This is a woman who definitely is carrying a lot of secrets. Your mother, mother figure, baby mama, um, aunt, grandmama, whatever. You've got someone that is just not speaking. Um, third party female on the low. Okay. Could also be a gay relationship for feminines on the low. And... Uh, yeah, someone's angry, bitter, and keeping that shit on the low, too. They be acting like they're not mad. Uh, this is someone's baby mom, though. I really feel that. Someone's pissed. All right, we have Pisces. You are next. Pisces or the person dealing with the Pisces. Secrets. What's the main thing we need to know right now? We have Three of Swords reversed and the Queen of Fire. So someone's trying to forgive and come back together with an Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, a female, female Pisces. Someone is very attracted to this person. Could be an ex coming back. Pisces, maybe you're the woman. You got someone coming back. But yeah, it's, it's forgiveness for sure. Someone's forgiving a fire sign. And Sagittarius. Your secrets, their secrets. The wheel, dang. And, whoops, the eight of wands, that's you. All right, things are changing quickly, and then all of a sudden, boom, it, it stops. Um, someone needs to travel but can't. Someone is waiting for the stars to align for things to actually show up, for things to actually manifest in real life. Um, if you are a Sag or dealing with one specifically, because we have Sag here in reverse, but the wheel is upright. So what you don't know is that things are working on the back end or you've got people working for you to make something happen. Uh, this one, why not? Cancer. Those dealing with a Cancer or, of course, you are Cancer. We have the Wheel again and the Eight of Swords. So um, you're dealing with an Air Sign or a Cancer or you are the Cancer. This is someone stuck in their head. Things are changing for them and they're not telling you. Um, they're ready to take a hike. Maybe you're ready to take a hike or someone is just like playing mind games. And the secret is that they're working with someone else to play mind games and hoping to turn the tide in their favor, okay? And we have Aquarius. Aquarius, your secrets are theirs. If you're dealing with one or are one. Okay, we have a high priestess and seven of swords. Nothing but liar, cheater, thief, affairs. The high priestess is the other woman. You could be the other woman. Uh, we have all Aquarius here and Pisces here. So we definitely have a third party situation going down or you are holding on to your thoughts, your feelings, you're keeping that shit a secret. You don't want nobody knowing your business. You're hiding the fact that you are the queen. However, however, you may be, um, someone may be going and speaking about you behind your back, lying about you behind your back. And of course, Libra. Okay, and of course, with that energy was Pisces and Air. So Libra, 
Your secrets are theirs. And we have nine of coins and the ten of swords reverse. Gemini and Virgo. Um, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Virgo, Taurus, or Capricorn, but strongest Gemini and Virgo. Uh, hiding that money, releasing the funds. If someone was single um, or newly single, you're, you weren't aware of this, but maybe you're becoming newly single. Okay, this could be your vibe right now. Okay, or you know someone who's becoming newly single. Also, it could be the end of the road for the job. You're ready to quit, but nobody knows you're quitting yet. So that's interesting. Oh my goodness. Okay, that'll do it for me today. We're just going to do that quick secrets check-in. And uh, check the membership this weekend. I'll be posting something special, some random mystery reading for you guys. And I'll see you soon. Bye.